there's a lot of stigma. And I think um, uh, to address that, it's, it's something that we have to do every day, not only um, today's sessions, but I believe that um, we are an individuals that we have our up and down. And for me uh, personally, is that you have your, your own uh, perspective of how you look at your mental health. Um, for, for, for me, uh, it's very important to nurture that, that, uh, that feelings and that uh, uh, emotions. And um, every one of us, uh, not only you uh, and, and, and other people in the community, but everyone should nurture that, uh, that environment uh, for either your loved one or people who know, or even our, our society as a whole, just to, to have that space to, to know what is, uh, to nurture uh, what is mental health. And everyone, everyone has uh, mental health issues. But to, be, to, to have that issue is resolved, to, to go through it um, with someone that means so much to, to, to a person, um, it's important. Um, and today, take away, I, I really, really enjoy all the questions that uh, the audience um, address. Uh, one thing I, I wanted everyone to keep in mind is that it could happen to anyone. It could happen to me, it could happen to you, it could happen to someone that you, you care and you love. Um, as a person who passions about mental um, health and mental illness uh, and grew up in a household that I see my grandparents as a refugees get accepted to this beautiful country and settle and we should be happy, right? But it, it could happen to anyone. And how do you, how do you uh, step in in the right time and to prevent something that it could be um, more severe I think that is the timely intervention. Um, for me at Hong Fook, we do early identifications and interventions um, and education. I think education is, is very important. And Healthy Mind did a great job of having us as a panel and different walk of life to, to talk about these issues. And I, I think um, it's, it's important for everyone to keep that in mind. Thank you.